Homicide Asian crimes in 2022 are actually down after sharp increases in 2021 and 2020. The stats from the Hate Crime Task Force come with an Many crimes are still under investigation and could be reclassified, which could bring those numbers up or down. Wins News Time 1207. Do you have bad credit but need a new car? Call Credit Solutions, a division of Hudson Hyundai. It's easy to apply right over the phone. Call 800-951-4221. Hudson Hyundai has over 425 vehicles in stock. Stop hunting and start driving a new Hyundai today. Tier 1 customers can drive a new Hyundai Tucson, Santa Fe, Palisade, or even the all-new fully electric Ionic 5. With only $68 down. That's just $68 down on over 425 cars, trucks, and SUVs in stock. Call 800-951-4221. That's 800-951-4221. And all new Hyundais come with Hyundai Assurance, an America's best 10-year, 100,000-mile warranty. Call Hudson Hyundai in Jersey City for a pre-approval. 800-951-4221. That's 800-951-4221. Or HudsonHyundai.com. Payments will vary. Credit severity affects approval. See dealer for details. Wait, news time, 1208. Police officers in New Jersey are allowed to use marijuana now as long as they are off duty. A memo from the state attorney general to police chiefs across the state yesterday said officers 21 and older can use any form of legally obtained recreational cannabis while off the job and can't be disciplined for that. Recreational marijuana becomes available in New Jersey next week. Officers are subject to drug tests. The memo says cannabis detected in these tests can't be cause for disciplinary action anymore. Police officers and even many civilian police employees in New York are still not allowed to use marijuana and can be disciplined. However, most New York state employers are prohibited by law from discriminating against workers for marijuana use outside of work. Wednesday News Time, 1209. You're the one who protects the flock, and that requires an eye for detail. Because when safety and well-being are on the line, it's the details that can save lives. Even when no one else is watching, you see everything. Granger gets you, and we're here for you. And all the ones who get it done with a wide range of safety products and solutions. Plus, board-certified safety consultants here to answer your questions. Call, click Granger.com, or just stop by. Granger for the one. This is a metaphor for your business's journey. Sometimes it feels like the world is throwing everything it has at you. And to succeed, you need someone to guide you through. That's what Dell Technologies Advisors do. They have the Windows PC and tech advice to help you navigate whatever challenges you're up against and get you safely to where you want to be. Call an advisor today at 877-ASK-DELL. That's 877-ASK-DELL. A start to a simpler experience with Windows 11 Pro. And now this message, Mets fans before every game, tune into the Nissan Mets pregame show on WCBS 880. Wins News Time 1210. Traffic and AccuWeather in one minute on 1010 Wins. Individuals and businesses with tax problems, listen carefully. Do you feel like you're losing control of your finances? If you owe over $10,000 in back taxes or have unfiled tax returns, we can help you take back control. The IRS is the largest and most aggressive collection agency in the world, and they can seize your bank accounts, garnish your pay Check. Close your business and file criminal charges. Take control of your tax problem now by calling the experts at U.S. Tax Shield and take advantage of the Fresh Start program and new laws that may allow us to negotiate a settlement for the lowest amount possible. Our team of tax attorneys and enrolled agents can stop collections and get you protected so you can take control of your financial future. U.S. Tax Shield offers a price protection guarantee quote to get you protected today. U.S. Tax Shield is A-plus rated with the Better Business Bureau, so call now. 800-656-4735. That's 800-656-4735. U.S. Tax Shield. 800-656-4735. Wednesday news time, 1211. Traffic and transit on the ones, and here's Bill Powers. And we're still dealing with some very heavy traffic over on the Grand Central Parkway. Head on up in towards City Field. Not only do we have the accident over by the LIE, but further west, as you head on up in towards the Queens Museum, a second crash. And traffic is really, really snarled. Your Grand Central delays 
still going back to right around Utopia Parkway, and uh, it's going to get worse. But the problem now is the LIE has now picked up a crash for you as well. This is going to be on the westbound side heading in towards Utopia Parkway, so that's going to jam things up even more for you. Lots of eastbound delays heading into the Grand Central, and you're seeing a lot of delays on the Whitestone Expressway right on down in towards the area around City Field. In the Bronx, bumper to bumper on the Cross Bronx Expressway, westbound side from pretty much White Plains Road all the way through to the GW Bridge, and once you get on to the Jersey side, still lots of delays on 8095 due to an accident. On the uh, Deegan northbound side, Yankee Stadium on up, you're on the brakes. Same deal over on the Harlem River Drive from the 150s. Lots of delays on the southbound Harlem River Drive from the uh, Willis Avenue Bridge, taking you on to the one teens, uh, obviously traveling on the FDR Drive. Now, here's what you need to know about your bridges and tunnels. Outbound GW Bridge, about a 20-minute wait. Inbound 15. Lincoln and Holland, both about 20 minutes for you. That's going to be in each direction. Saturday parking rolls, or alternate side, I should say. They are suspended today. That is all due to the Passover holiday. Meter rolls apply. I'm Bill Powers. Next report, 1221 on 1010 Winds. Jackpot can let you play official state lottery games on your phone. Powerball is now over $325 million. Use code RADIO for a free ticket. Plus the 18 or older to play. If you or someone you know has a gambling problem and wants help, call 1-877-HOPE-NY. Please visit jackpocket.com slash TOS for full terms of service. Wind news time, 12-13. Now the 10-10 winds. AccuWeather four-day forecast. And here's meteorologist Carl Babinski. We are currently partly sunny, and it is 65 degrees in Midtown. We're going to be close to 68 before the day is through, but we're keeping an eye on 10-10 winds up the radar, and a cold front approaching will trigger a couple of showers, probably after 3 or 4 p.m., and these will last into early this evening. Now, any shower will be capable not only of producing gusty winds, but even some rumbles of thunder and small hail. A cold front, the culprit, and once that uh, front pushes through, late tonight will dry out, but it'll be much chillier. So 68 today, but then we'll tumble to 42 on this Saturday night. Tomorrow, Easter Sunday, it'll be a bright and sunny day, just very chilly, especially in the morning. Highs in the low, uh, low 50s, but for morning uh, Easter festivities, be mindful. You'll need that jacket. It'll be in the low 40s. Now, tomorrow night should be dry. Monday, sun will be followed by clouds, high 54. We do expect some rain to begin late in the day. Rain Monday night and Tuesday could be accompanied by a gusty wind. It'll all depend on the future track of a nor'easter that'll be forming just offshore. Currently, it's 65 and partly sunny. Relative humidity, 33%. The wind, good variable, gusting to 20 miles per hour. Partly sunny, 65, going up to 68 in Midtown. I'm AccuWeather Meteorologist Kara Babinski on New York's weather station, 1010 Winds. Winds News Time, 1214. All over America, people are taking the National Radon Test. Have you? Answer true or false. Radon is a radioactive gas. True. I didn't know that, no. True or false. The Office of the Surgeon General recommends that all homes be tested for radon. True, your home should be tested. True or false, radon is the second leading cause of lung cancer. True. I'm going to dial the number and call. 1-800-SOS-RADON. Keep your family safe from radon. Call now. 1-800-SOS-RADON. Emmy Award winner Deborah Messing has just returned to Broadway in birthday candles. And the Daily News raves, this is exactly what Broadway is missing. A poignant, funny look at the extraordinary moments that make up a woman's ordinary life. This 90-minute marvel is an icing sweet pleasure, says Deadline. And Variety Cheers, birthday candles is a true gift. Don't miss Deborah Messing in what the Daily News calls a truly must-see show. Birthday candles. Visit roundabouttheater.org. With news time 12:15, in a possible preview of campaign debate in 2024, the governor of Texas, Greg Abbott, says he's sending busloads of asylum seekers to D.C. That's a move in protest of the White House rollback of a controversial public health rule known as Title 42. It allowed law enforcement to immediately deport most people crossing the border. Those buses have begun arriving in the nation's capital. It didn't seem to us that there were any local law enforcement there to meet the bus, but there were representatives from Catholic Charities. They gave them some food and water and a chance just to figure out what's next. Well, that's correspondent Mary Alice Parks and lawmakers on both sides of the aisle, including both Democratic senators from Arizona, are warning the Biden administration is not prepared for what could be a rush of additional migrants to the border. It's a holiday weekend, Easter, Passover, and vacations from school and work. Lots of people hitting the road and flying, and there's a shortage of TSA agents at the airports, not to mention a shortage, a shortage of pilots with the airlines. 
The biggest crowds are expected Monday. This weekend could break pandemic and even pre-pandemic records. This all comes after several weekends of mass cancellations due to weather and staffing shortages. And because of the latter, JetBlue is cutting back on flights by 10%. United says they expect to see more than 400,000 passengers per day. That is 70% more than this time last year. Delta with nearly half a million. Correspondent Elwin Lopez at Atlanta's Hartsfield Jackson Airport. We have news time 12 17. At Optimum, each one of us are working every day to reconnect with you. And employee by employee, bit by bit, we're bringing some big changes. Take me. I'm working hard to bring Optimum Fiber, a new 100% fiber internet network, into your home for more speed and reliability. And me? I can help customers combine that with Optimum Mobile, now on the T-Mobile network, so they can stay seamlessly connected at home and on the go. I love telling my customers that they can have the flexibility to choose the products that work for them with no force bundles or annual contracts. When I help solve issues, I strive to keep your satisfaction my top priority. In fact, we're always here for you with support in-store or online and over the phone 24-7. But beyond helping you, we're also helping our community. By donating millions to public schools and local organizations. To empower the next generation of innovators. And little by little, all that progress adds up to something much bigger. Reconnecting with you and what you love. So let's reconnect. See all the progress we're making at Optimum.com slash reconnect. 65 degrees getting up to 68 this afternoon. Celebrate spring at Banana Republic Factory with 50 to 70% off everything. Discover vibrant dresses, modern suits, and more from $24.99. Find your nearest store or shop online only at Banana Republic Factory. With news time 1218, if you procrastinated when it comes to filing your taxes, this is crunch time. Monday is your last day to avoid a penalty. Correspondent Deidre Bolton has some last minute tips. You should file electronically. 96% of all individual returns are filed this way and those who qualify can do so for free. Make sure to file for deductions. Most accountants say taking the standard deduction works best for most people. Remember to submit what you already received for that child tax care credit. You'll get the rest of the money owed to you when the rest of your file is submitted. And if there is no way you can meet the Monday deadline, for whatever reason, you can request an extension. But if you owe money, you still have to pay by Monday, even if you turn in the rest of your paperwork late. Wins News Time, 1219. The IRS, the world's most aggressive collection agency. They can seize your property, bank account, and garnish your wages. They cause sleepless nights for millions of Americans. Don't be one of them. If you owe $10,000 or more to the IRS or state, get protected today. Call 800-601-8802. Coast One Tax Group. Protecting your bank, home, and your sleep since 2008. With hundreds of five-star reviews and an A-plus on the Better Business Bureau. Call Coast One Tax Group. 800-601-8802. Stanley from New York owed $93,000. The IRS placed a levy on his bank account. Coast One released the levy and settled with the IRS for $2,000. Mark in Michigan owed $225,000. After Coast One stepped in, Mark walked away paying less than $1,500. Call Coast One now. A 10-minute call can save you up to 93% on your back taxes. Get your fresh start today. That's 800-601-8802. Live and local, 24 hours a day, your all-news station, 1010 Wins. All news, all the time. This is 1010 Wins. You give us 22 minutes, we'll give you the world. Good afternoon, it's 65 degrees at 1220. I'm Sonia Rincon, and here's what's happening. A Brooklyn father with a high-profile family and criminal history is arrested in the death of his infant daughter last fall. The medical examiner found the baby died of heroin and fentanyl intoxication. A Brooklyn man is now charged in three attacks on Sikhs in Richmond Hill considered hate crimes. The mayor of Kiev with a warning to citizens who want to return as there are new deadly Russian strikes in that city as Russia sends a diplomatic memo to the U.S. and its allies. The city is likely to step up the COVID alert to medium in the next few days with increasing cases. And the Mets are honoring the family of Gil Hodges this afternoon. In sports, the Mets are hosting Arizona. The Yankees are in Baltimore again tonight. The Rangers hosting Detroit. The Devils in Seattle. And the Red Bulls hosting Dallas. 
Same thing with AccuWeather cloudy, breezy, mild, a shower or two that could intensify into a heavy, gusty storm. The high 66 degrees and tonight, partly cloudy, low 42. Wednesday's time, 12 21. Traffic and transit on the ones, and here's Bill Powers. Bumper to bumper on the eastbound Belt Parkway. You got a wreck over by Rockaway Boulevard, and your delay is going to begin back before the Van Wick. Westbound side, some rubbernecking delays through that area, and then we're going to see some additional slowdowns heading in towards Cross Bay Boulevard. We got some more eastbound delays for you as well. This just appears to be volume as you cruise from around Mill Basin all the way up in towards Starrett City. That's on the eastbound side. And some additional westbound delays now. Looks like from around Ocean Parkway up in towards the uh, Verrazano Bridge. Plenty of company there. Also, as we stay in Brooklyn, still a tough go for you both directions on the BQE heading in towards Atlantic Avenue. Staten Island Expressways picked a lot of extra company up on the westbound trip. Pretty much from the beginning all the way out in towards the 440. Once you get past 440, things will improve. And it's not a bad ride getting across the Gothels Bridge. Here's what else you need to know about your bridges and tunnels. Over at the Outer Bridge, minor delays. It's going to cost you 10 to 15 at the Lincoln as well as the Holland. GW Bridge, that's going to cost you about uh, 20 minutes on the outbound side, 20 minutes on the inbound side. Whether you go upper or lower, it does not matter. And if you're heading over to City Field, uh, no matter where you go, Grand Central, the Whitestone Expressway, as well as the LIE, pack your patience. Lots of delays. I'm Bill Powers. Your next report's coming up at 1231 on 1010 Winds. An arrest in a tragedy in Park Slope connected to a family known for literary drama and real-life involvement in a high-profile crime. Police say 44-year-old Daniel Oster has been charged with manslaughter in the death of his baby last fall. The medical examiner says 10-month-old Ruby Oster died back in November as a result of heroin and fentanyl intoxication. It's not clear how that happened, but Daniel Oster has a mysterious criminal history. He's the son of novelist and actor Paul Oster. And in 1998, when he was 20, Daniel Oster was convicted in connection with the death of a high-profile drug dealer. It was known as the Club Kid Murder. At the time, he was a student at SUNY Purchase. He pleaded guilty to possession of stolen property, and it was never explained how he ended up with $3,000 belonging to murdered nightclub fixture Angel Melendez. Two other people were convicted of killing him. Daniel Oster's dad, Paul Oster, is a well-known novelist, author of the New York Trilogy and the screenplay of the movie Smoke with Harvey Keitel. Wins News Time 1224. There have been new attacks on Ukraine's capital, even as Russian forces are moving east, and there's been a warning from Kiev's mayor. Another difficult day here. There were new airstrikes here in Kiev, and one missile landed on an apartment building on the outskirts of the city. The mayor says that one person was killed and several were hurt as this war enters its 52nd day. And the mayor warning citizens who have left not to return. Russia has reportedly sent a formal diplomatic memo to the U.S. and its allies warning them to stop supplying military aid to Ukraine. A U.S. official briefed on Russia's note confirms to ABC News that the Kremlin is accusing the U.S. of violations that could put weapons in the hands of bad actors. And this, of course, is not the first time Russia has basically threatened the U.S. Tensions between the world's two largest nuclear powers are at their highest in recent years. Just last month, the Kremlin warned the U.S. and NATO that Western convoys carrying military aid to Ukraine are, quote, legitimate targets for Russian attack. That's correspondent Faith Bube in Washington. Wednesday News Time 1225. Solomons is offering a free home security system and installation when you use their low-cost central station monitoring. Call 833-933-SAFE. That's 833-933-SAFE. The YMCA is just a starting line for the true self born Only when we find our purpose, what makes us tick, below the surface. My why is diversity in unity, a safe space in my community, living with sincerity, giving every day my everything. With my why, I stand strong, seen and supported all along. It's a million faces in a mirror and everyone along. Find your why. Learn more at YMCA.org for a better us. Who better to treat your cancer than John Thurer Cancer Center, whose specialists with 30 years experience are part of a division solely dedicated to treating patients with multiple myeloma, who provide innovative treatments including CAR-T 